It was a violent weekend in Peoria with dozens of rounds fired off throughout the city. Good Monday evening. I'm Tyler Lopez. And I'm Amber Kriska. Thank you for joining us. Lizzie Siles looks at the dangerous last few days and what local leaders are doing about it. Lizzie? Tyler and Amber, between Saturday and Sunday, 73 rounds were fired in the city of Peoria, according to ShotSpotter data, resulting in five people getting shot. Now, none of those gunshot wounds were fatal, but a community leader says this is creating an all-hands-on-deck situation. Um, it's not normal at all. And no, it's, it's, it's not just life. Uh, and, you know, no one should have to be exposed to, to this type of thing. Over the course of two days, Peoria police responded to 10 calls involving firearms. Not all were shootings, but five people were sent to the hospital with injuries. All this after a series of firearms related arrests Thursday and Friday, including the city's latest homicide of 25 year old Demetrius Davis. 21 year old Ronnie Simmons was arrested and charged with that murder. We reached out to Peoria police. They tell us there are no updates to the list of incidents over the weekend. We pressed further for some kind of statement or acknowledgement from their spokesperson, but that message went unanswered. Our calls also went to voicemail. Carl Holloway, who runs May I Community Outreach, is concerned about the young teens and kids getting involved in these crimes. Sunday, a 14-year-old was shot near these apartment complexes. At the same time, he has confidence in city officials. Everyone should have eyes and hands on deck. I do truly believe at this moment, as we're speaking right now, they're sitting at the table coming up with um, some, some, some additional plans. On the scene of a Sunday afternoon shooting where Wayne and Perry streets intersect, a decade-long resident fatigued by the violence and the young people wrapped up in it. It's kind of like part of the neighborhood, you know? I know it kind of sounds maybe an oxymoron that, you know, you don't get used to, but at the same time you do, you know, it's just, it's, you know, it's hard to explain. We reached out to Mayor Rita Ali as well. She was not in her office today, but was willing to set up another time to speak with us. There is also another meeting of the city's safety network on Friday.